Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I am here with Sorat Online Elicization War of Genre World 2 and uh, this is episode number 5. Uh, previously uh, things were already kind of messy. In the previous ep episode it somehow got even messier. Like, uh, like all of these disadvantages stacking up one upon another, one upon another and uh, like uh, this is all like uh, what do you call it culminating into something like uh, when Kyoto is going to come, uh, wake up he's going to wake up with a bang and uh, <laughs> like I'm pretty excited like uh, this time of anxiety and uh, what do you call it Dis uh, what do you, uh, uneasiness or annoyance I felt this before like uh, when I was watching Shield Hero, like all the characters were so dumb and all, like they were like exceedingly stupid, like th that, like all of the characters uh, except for Naofumi and his team were like so dumb, like the the, the dumbness made my head hurt, like <laughs> it was such an annoyance. And this is completely different. This is not because they're dumb, but because they're annoying. They're simply annoying, like all of these enemy characters. <laughs> Anyways, I I'm uh, just uh, rambling about all of that. Uh, without further ado, let's get started with uh, episode number 5 of Alicization. Okay, I'll be counting down. 3, 2, 1, go! Okay, you is here. Old server. Wait, did someone come from SAO over here? Who could have come? Mm. Like I, uh, like the sleeping, uh, what called the laughing coffin members? What was them? Pooh, isn't it? Yeah. He is like an SAO survivor, and other than that, who else? Hmm, I can't remember. Oh, in the previous episode, uh, Kiryu was brought out, wasn't he? Yeah, in that wheelchair. Who kind of like um, uh, ordered them to br bring him out? Prince of Hell. Okay, let's see how much worse can this get. Oh boy. And here we go. Crying. If he woke up now, like this guy would be falling down on the ground. Oh, my God. Now, this is triggering me. Oh god, like... <laughs> just just kicking him in the balls. <laughs> oh my god. That's a perfect position for kicking. <laughs> oh my... Oh, okay. Huh? 
I'm Klein. Okay. Oh God. Like what? The? Yeah, this guy was the instigator of everything. Like from the uh, from SIO. Who is that? Okay, who is that? Who is that? Who the hell? Age? Wait a sec. Who is this? I forgot. Like, was it from SAO? Wait, 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 wait. I, I just can't remember who. Like, I, I can remember his name kind of like AG. Okay. Shut the hell up, dude. Like, is he using some skill to like brainwash them? I think some. It is in something among that line. Oh, she's here. I forgot her name. What was her name? Um, from the movie, uh, Ordinal Scale. Uh, Yuna, Yuna. Oh, Ag. I, I, I remembered. He's from the, uh, you know, movie as well. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I kind of remembered. What's that music? Th this is sounding like Yuki Kajiura's music, isn't it? Okay, okay, now this will be a bit like problem for the enemy. Oh my god. Damn! Okay, 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 come on, come on. I want to get see this guy get beat up. Which is cancelling the mind control or whatever that was. You know, yeah. Thank God, like Oof. Damn. Oh, missed it. Okay. What? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Like, wait a second. So, is he not from ordinal scale? I, I, I'm, I'm really confusing everything. Like, he is from ordinal scale, isn't it? My memory is really fuzzy. Like, okay. Okay. Okay, um Yes, yes, come on, come on. Slice him, slice him, slice him. Two piece. I want two piece. Okay, we'll get to that later on. It's looking like Subaru, what the hell? <laughs> like his facial structure and everything. Yeah, he's just like Subaru. This is Subaru. What is this?
Oh, okay. So they had beef in the real world as well. <laughs> oh God. Ah. Come on. Oh, oh no, no. Please, please don't like. Oh my God. What the hell happened? Everything was going. Okay, wasn't it? America, San Francisco. Um then you're the devil yourself. What the hell are you saying? Okay, I, I get I see where this is going. Yep. He he want his kidney like. Yep. Wait a second, is this like brother like that guy? AG? Oh my god. Okay, now now I get it, like his hatred. Hmm, okay. Oh, wait a second, so that means he logged in during the same incident. Or am I misunderstanding something? Prince of Hell, oh, poo. Okay. Oh no, sorry, I, I made a mistake here. Like, his brother and AJ are not the same. Like, I think that was my mistake. Okay, come on. Or is it? I have a lot to talk about later on. Like, Okay, so Yuna was... Wait, now what happens? Like, are they like... They're returning to the real world, world isn't it? Okay, now he's going to brainwash them again. Yep. Oh, 
ओके वेल नाउ द फायर स्टार्टेड फाइटिंग अमाउंट सेंसेल्स लाइक Okay, uh, we're coming here. Like, vic oh, oh my God! Ah, uh, seven rounds per magazine. Okay. Ten rounds. Okay, that is a big disadvantage. Okay, now what will you do? Oh God! Oh God! Oh my God! Okay. Oh my God. and this is bad this is pretty bad oh okay. oh my god i like this uh, hand splitting out like What is this become like a ghost show? Um you can attach them just like that. Okay, she'll heal it. Oh my god, la. Okay, so she's like experiencing the pain but is able to recover. Okay. Ah, uh, stressing. Using those skill uh, one after the other like that's take Oh my god. Oh my god, what the hell? What has this become like Sora don't was never like this. My God! Like, <laughs> like the genre is changing. Like, okay, okay, that thing saved him. Her, right. yes. system features okay automatically resolve resources from oh okay so hikate also inherited that power and he would be able to save himself from that as well like i'm guessing like this guy is like overpowered okay he he is wounded how does it feel huh
why don't you get a taste of your own soul like that 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 might be pretty good was isn't it okay he went away wow <laughs> like this guy gets beaten up once and he goes away just like that Hmm. Okay, what is happening here? A lot of things are happening at the same time. Who the hell? Okay, what was that? Yes! Good! This is just what I wanted. Thank God. God damn it, like... <laughs> yeah Well, <laughs> well, she didn't get that completely. Like, <laughs> anyways, <laughs> mm, kind of. Okay, blood loss, blood loss. You should probably cover that up. Okay, will he like wake up now? This is, ha is this happening? Okay, they're like using their memories for him, isn't it? Yeah, to reconstruct his. his. Okay, yeah, they're, they're using their memories for, like, to reconstruct him as a data. And there is Yujiyo. Okay, this is from the opening. Oh my god, it's end? Okay, that felt really short. Like, yeah. This was a satisfying episode. Like, all of that grudge from the previous episodes and everything. And it kind of... It kind of became okay now. And I'm happy. <laughs> like, the previous few episodes were just... Like, so much stress and everything. Okay. I'm happy. I'm really happy this episode, and, and I hope. I, I I mean, not hope, but I think that in the next episode they will like kind of like go with Kirito and Yuji are talking and sorting everything out, and uh, like at the end he would probably wake up, and from the like this episode five, in episode six he's going to get like you just going to get, give him a little pep talk and everything, <laughs> and. <laughs> Uh, ask you to, to go just wake up your friends are waiting and he'll probably wake up at the end of the episode 6 and in episode 7 I think things are going to go down uh, like I'm waiting for that I'm really waiting for that <laughs> oh my god hmm that over yep
memories yep just as i said like next episode will be probably dedicated to with him like sorting himself out and everything okay this episode like i'm happy i'm happy i'm extremely happy with this episode and uh, <laughs> like <laughs> in the pre- previous few episodes it was like what do you call it like so t- stressful and annoying not annoying but it, it was exceedingly st- frustrating like seeing everything like <laughs> and going not the way you want um and like th- they're getting beaten unfairly like the enemy f- uh, team has an unfair advantage here so and okay now uh, let me talk about something here like uh, i really forgot ob- about ordinal scale like in sao alo and ggo i kind of like watched them two or three times like that's why my memory is still fresh about them but ordinal scale i just w- watched only one time i remember kind of what happened like uh, but like uh, the the characters and everything are not coming into my mind like i remember yuna like she was the main character there and um, like uh, ag like um, was was that the guy like who was with yuna um, i think that is like uh, like i was in this episode i was really confused because of my like short memory uh, i was really confused about who ag was like at the first time uh, when he came alone i was unable to recognize him i thought that he was might be someone from sao and technically he is from sao so um, so i was like really confused like who is this guy and then when yuna came in like i kind of like correlated them and i kind of like it came into my mind like yeah this guy must be from that uh, movie and like I, again in the middle i was like also confused i thought like uh, like uh, he he was it is said that he is from sao like it is shown that he was from sao and yuna was also from sao and uh, so i was also like really confused like is this the guy really the guy from ordinal scale and uh, i think th- this is like the guy from ordinal scale and so he was also a sao survivor and this is the first thing that confused me second thing the second thing that confused me was like uh, when pu was telling his story and uh, his back story was being shown um uh, we saw that his father had kind of like another child uh, like uh, he was a half sibling and uh, like he said that you have to donate your kidneys for that uh, for my child uh, and everything and he donated the kidney so like at first i thought that yeah this guy that is this brother must be ag and then in the middle i kind of thought that no uh, is it really ag like uh, is ag and the, his brother like the same person or like this is my uh, misconception like I, i'm uh, confusing with all of this and then again at the uh, end like i thought that yeah this guy must be ag like ag and his brother is the same isn't it now i'm asking this you guys this question like uh, if you have uh, um, like if you know the answer please uh, rectify me like uh, clear this thing up for me in the comment section because uh, like is uh, pu's brother half sibling uh, like same as ag like is uh, ag the online avatar of that guy uh that is the second thing that was confusing me if you guys have an answer to that please uh like uh make <laughs> like write um, write that in the comment section so that that thing gets uh, cleared and another thing that can kind of confused me was like that, that was not confusion i, I want to like uh, make sure like here it is said that uh, we, we saw like ag was like uh, he was like frustrated with everything and after he kind of grew up to a teenager uh, like uh, the news was showing that uh, sao incident has happened like uh, the thing with nerf gear and everything so like did he like after the sao incident happened did he like smuggle in a nerf gear and uh, like log in during that time like uh, during the time when everyone was trapped did he log in during that time like that is my question here because like uh, this thing must have happened during that time like he was not an sao player but after this incident happened he f- found that yeah this is a good opportunity to kill japanese people so he smuggled in a nerf gear which was kind of banned at that time because of that incident so he smuggled in the nerf gear and logged in during that incident like that takes, if that really is the thing that happened that takes a lot of guts and uh, not guts like he was reckless he, he just wanted revenge on like uh, like uh, clear that out for me as well like um 
is that the thing that happened i think that is what happened because who was the like main instigator of the, everything that happened like uh, that false information spreading and everything in the previous episode we uh, heard that uh, so like he must have been present in sao when this all of these things was going down so that must be it like he took the, he smuggled in the nerf gear and illegal like uh, kind of entered it during everything was happening uh, i think that is uh, like these are the three things that are kind of confusing me on in this episode and uh, like uh, like <laughs> i really want to be like clear about that i'll also like uh, research it I, i'm kind of like uh, scared to research it online because uh, it might spoil me spoil me about something else like i'm i'm, I'm trying to research something else and i get spoiled about something else like I, i'm a bit like hesitant because of that reason so if you guys have uh, like uh, if you guys know the answer uh, please uh, clear clarify uh, that for me in the comment section and um, okay uh, okay that was all the like um, confusion that I was having in this episode other than that um, and yeah like pool <laughs> looks a lot like subaru in his young uh, like I, I mean when he was young like at first i was like what was Su what is subaru doing here <laughs> did you get isekai again <laughs> okay um uh, like uh, yeah he, he really yeah he, like he really looks a lot like subaru like like take this portion here uh, i'm i'm putting this over here like look at this isn't this subaru <laughs> like <laughs> anyways um i find that kind of funny like uh, his body structure and everything like uh, heavily resembles subaru and um okay so that was that and uh, what else was here hmm we uh, like we kind of get why uh, ag was like so uh, frustrated and everything and revengeful but still like uh, the, there's one thing that i uh, what do you call it i think and i really uh, believe is that uh, like people have unfortunate circumstances like uh, a lot of people have unfortunate circumstances and um, like uh, i get it that you were like kind of uh, abused in the young age young age but you should not vent that out on other innocent people like that is not correct <laughs> you can vent that out on your dad on your father definitely because he was the instigator of that but what did the other people do that they're, they're not like uh, they, they did not commit any crime or they they are not responsible for your situation so why torment other people because of someone else's sin like i've seen this in a lot of anime here and there like like i get it like you're venting your frustrations you have nothing else to do like you you want a uh, uh, what do you call it you want a uh, objective an ambition like to follow and revenge being the only thing that is circulating in your mind you kind of latch into that and uh, use that Uh, as your means for your own uh, what do you call it uh, salvation but that does not save you that is not salvation that is just like you're injecting painkillers inside your blood stream just to feel relief after that uh, thing like kind of wears out what will you be left with nothing hollow you'll be hollow inside like this is a thing that happened with naruto and sasuke like uh, sasuke wanted revenge and after revenge was over he became like there's nothing left for him same thing is happening here like he wanted like he wanted to vent his frustrations he did not like the japanese i get it like uh, but uh, because of one bad person in japan you can't like uh, um, relate him his sin to every, each and every other people in japan as well like your dad was japanese he did something bad to you that doesn't mean that each and every japanese are bad like th that doesn't work that way and i get it like he is like what do you call it like he was kind of like jealous of everything his he was also jealous of his half sibling and everything else and uh, that was the thing that kind of pushed him to the edge <laughs> but like um killing people for that indirectly killing people for that no no that that, that is not that is not the way and um that was the thing with who or as you know prince of hell and uh, what else okay the thing with seen on here um like uh, again the, the pendant safe seen on anyways i'm not talking about that the thing that <laughs> vector <laughs> like 
kind of got blasted and uh, after seeing that yeah uh, Sino needs bad news now he kind of went away like that was really hilarious like he was all talking uh, like uh, talking big things like yeah uh, like I'm the best I'm going to ki kill you I'm going to taste your soul yada yada and uh, after getting a taste of Sinon's hyper beam <laughs> he, he, he thought like uh, okay like I I'm at a pretty disadvantage here I, I should probably like go away from here so so she kind of went he kind of went away and I don't know if he like went away to like heal or something or he's going to come back but anyways he's out of the picture now like uh, temporarily and I'm happy about that and uh, like uh, this guy this soul fetishist guy like if you really have so much uh, like you want to taste soul so much <laughs> you would probably guess get a taste of a soul uh, before leaving this place that is your own soul and i hope that you are happy about that like when kirito finally destroys you in this environment you'll probably get a taste of your own soul and I hope that it's able to satisfy you for the rest of your life and you never do anything like this again <laughs> like I'm really pissed off at this guy like uh, like like <laughs> I'm pissed off at everything okay and another thing that was cleared out here was that um, I thought that the um, other guys who were like fighting for Vector were like um, uh, no not Vector sorry uh, for Pooh and uh, I thought that uh, they must be like uh, doing that due to their own stupidity but Apparently that is not the case here. The, they came in because they were lured in by that kind of thing, like uh, justice thingy, like uh, we are being uh, oppressed, help us, Japanese are uh, like uh, hacking into our system. And they were kind of like lured in because of that. But uh, like uh, they also like showed hesitation after coming in. But I think who kind of brainwashed them. So that is the reason why they were like uh, acting that way. And he's still brainwashing them. And at least a few others like um, what was their name um, moon moonshine or something like uh, th those uh, characters they are at least like out of the brainwash like they're not affected by that and um, okay what else was in this episode let's see we got to see like uh, Lifa's thing that as she said like as she was like uh, a healing kind of like uh, character and he use he's using the character which is like a healer or something uh, so she is uh, suffering pain for everything for like uh, hand cutting and everything but she's able to regenerate them like this is like <laughs> what can i say that, that is quite painful and like uh, i've never seen like soda online but i i like i i know that soda online was uh, had blood in it and everything but uh, Oh no, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, it became gory in al alicization, like in part one also, the thing that happened with Quinella and everything. It was also gory at that time, but not as much as this one, like I guess I can like kind of like see like hands getting cut off everything, those are kind of acceptable, <laughs> but like uh, a spear like like guarding her eyes with a spear and like it being stuck into your eyes and like uh, uh, blood coming out. <laughs> No, th that is traumatizing like <laughs> what can I say like I was really shocked at that time like when uh, he kind of like fling flung the spear and it uh, stuck into Leafa's eye like I was really surprised at uh, like that and th that was really like what can I say <laughs> gory and everything they're like amping it up amping it up everything and the thing with Higa like um, he scored a date <laughs> at the end but I really hope that he kind of like uh, gets out of this uh, unharmed because like we were seeing his vision becoming blurry and everything uh, that is because of blood loss and I really hope that he kind of like <laughs> survives this thing whole thing and Kirito would probably be waking up in one or two episodes and I'm excited for that. Okay guys, that was this episode. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed my reaction, press the like button and subscribe if you are new or you have not subscribed and uh, comment down below. Uh, like uh, in this episode, definitely comment down below because uh, I want uh, my clarifications 
uh, in the the three like uh, mis uh, like not misunderstandings but the three uh, confusion that I had in this episode I talked about it uh, like uh, uh, at the start like uh, like at the end of the episode uh, like uh, please like if you guys know the answer like uh, clarify that for me because I really don't want to research this online because if I do that I might get spoiled uh, whatever is happening anyways uh, so yeah uh, comment down below and uh, yes I'll be back with a new Zero Dark Sword Art Online episode next week until then goodbye and have a nice day